Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. So my last video was why 4K sucks. So stands to reason why this video would be why 4K is awesome. Reasons why 4K is awesome. So we discussed the, the reasons why we don't like it in the last video or the potential reasons why you might not like it. Obviously, the biggest reason that 4K is awesome. Oh, and by the way, Superman shirt today, folks. For those of you that like the shirts. Anyways, the biggest reason 4K is awesome is because basically it's the latest and greatest in the term of video and video resolution and where we're going with that. So just by its inherent qualities, it's awesome. It's got more resolution than anything else to date. It's going to bring us the most detail we've ever seen. Very, very fine detail in, um, in our videos. We'll be able to watch detail like we've, we've never seen before. So um, you actually probably, because of this detail, this brings up point number two. You could actually take stills out of 4K video. And um, I don't have this, the numbers right here in front of me on what that translate like a, a frame of 4K video, what the X and Y axis is on that for pixels. But obviously we're bigger than 1920 by 1080. Um, so we're probably into you know, um, 2,000, 3,000 on one end. So you've got what we used to shoot with um, around a six megapixel camera still. So it might even negate the need to shoot photos. And that's a whole other discussion again, but um, certainly a much better ability to pull stills out of, bring it out of freeze frame, save, there you go, boom, you got a still from 4K video much better image than you've got out of 1080 video. So one of our problems that we discussed with 4K in the last one was the um, was the size causing more the need for more processing power and more storage. So when we get into three, and um, this isn't so much a point of it being awesome other than the sense of it's driving technology forward, which is awesome. But it's probably going to bring with it the need for more advanced codecs, more advanced compression algorithms, so that we're going to have something even better than H.264 that hopefully will work even nicer with our higher-end computers so we're not going to be having the problems with uh, them slowing down when they're trying to crunch this stuff. So uh, I would expect that to happen once 4K is more prevalent on the market. Likewise, the next point would be then that... Um, that advancement and the prevalency of 4K on the market is going to drive the prices down, like we're already starting to see in monitors, um, so that you'll be able to get a 4K monitor for, for much cheaper. And eventually it'll be the, the cost we're currently paying for a non-4K monitor or a non-4K TV or even cheaper. So it's just basically supply and demand. As we make things and there's more demand for things, the cost goes down because it's uh, there's more of them being made. And I think you're going to see that happen with monitors and with televisions. Hopefully we'll see that with storage as well. Not only should we get a new Kodak, new compression algorithms, but hopefully we'll see storage drop or continue to drop. It, it's, storage has been interesting, uh, hard drive space and whatnot, because it's gone way down and then we had some issues with weather and things. Some of the manufacturing plants were damaged and storage went up again. And then it was up for a while and then storage came down again. But I don't think it's still quite down to where its lowest point was before the weather problems that created uh, manufacturing issues. So it remains to be seen about storage. Um, but again, there's quite a few points there that are great. Um, and I guess you can sum up these ones basically that 4k is going to drive technology for it which is awesome for all of us and i guess the biggest thing is just the fact that 4k is, is uh, the most advanced most highest resolution we've seen yet so it's pretty cool that way what do you think folks uh, is 4k of interest to you do you disagree with my positives on it on why 4k is awesome have i missed one put it in the comments below let's have a good chat about it uh keep things civil we'll talk to you soon here at artoftheimage.com thanks a lot folks